Hey. Hey. Where is everybody? They took Ben to the park. Where have you been? Just out. Had some lunch. Just me. Little quality time with me. <laughs> hey, thanks for your jacket. Oh, no problem. You can borrow it, by the way. <laughs> oh, here are your keys, hon. Thank you. Mon? Mm-hmm? If uh, you were at lunch alone, how come it cost you uh, $53? You know what probably happened? <laughs> Someone must have stolen my credit card. Uh. <laughs> and sort of just put the receipt back in your pocket. <laughs> that is an excellent, excellent question. <laughs> that is excellent. <laughs> Monica, what's with you? Who did you have lunch with? Judy? Who? Julie? What? Jody? <laughs> you were with Julie? Oh, look, when it started, I, I was just trying to be nice to her because she was my brother's girlfriend. And then well, one thing led to another, and before I knew it, we were shopping. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Wait, we only did it once. It didn't mean anything to me. Yeah, right. Really? Sure. Rachel, I was thinking of you the whole time. Look, I'm sorry, all right? I, I never meant for you to find out. Oh, please, please. You wanted to get caught. That is not true. Oh, so you just sort of happened to leave it in here? Did it ever occur to you that I might just be that stupid? <laughs> okay, Monica, I just have to know one thing. Did you go with her to Bloomingdale's? <laughs> okay. Okay. So what do you say, boy? Should I call him? <laughs> well, you know what they say. Ask your slippers a question. You're going crazy. Hello? Hey. Hey! Listen, I'm, I'm sorry I didn't make it over there today. Oh. That's okay, you, uh, you had a thing. Yeah, well, I hear the place looks great. Oh, forget about it, I'm having a ball. <laughs> How's the apartment doing? Oh, hey, it's, it's terrific. I mean, it's a regular space. Fest. <laughs> oh, well, great. Yeah, I just... You know, wanted to call and say, hey. <laughs> well, okay then. Was that the oven timer? That's right, my friend. It's time for... Baby Watch! Watch. <laughs> oh. Can you believe they gave Stephanie skin cancer? I still can't believe they promoted her to lieutenant. Wow, uh, you're just saying that because you're in love with Yasmin Bleep. Well, how could anyone not be in love with Yasmin Bleep? <laughs> hey, hey, they're running. See, this is the brilliance of the show. I say always keep them running. All the time running. Run. Run. Run, Yasmin, run like the wind. But I thought you wanted to live by yourself. I did. I thought it'd be great. I figured I'd have, like, time alone with my thoughts, but, you know, turns out I don't have as many thoughts as you'd think. Why don't you talk to Chandler about moving back? You really think he'd take me? I mean, we had a pretty good talk last night, but when I moved out, I heard him bad. I promise you, he would definitely want you back. I'm telling you, there's no way he's moving back. <laughs> but we had one of the greatest talks we ever had last night. <laughs> I mean, it was, it was like when we first started living together. <laughs> Look, I know you don't want to hear this right now, but We've seen him in his new place, all right? And he's happy. He's... He's decorated. Look, Chandler, 
He has moved on, okay? You have to, too. But no, you're just gonna have to accept the fact that you're just friends now, okay? You're not roommates anymore. All right, no peeking. No peeking. No peeking. No peeking. All right, all right. But you better be wearing clothes when I open my eyes. All right, open your eyes. Sweet mother of all that is good and pure. <laughs> huh? Days of our lives picked up my option. Congratulations! I know. <laughs> now we can finally watch Green Acres the way it was meant to be seen. Uh -huh. So, uh, which one is mine? Whichever one you want, man. Whichever one you want. <laughs> Not that one. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yeah, that's the stuff. Oh. Do we dare? We dare. Oh. Oh. I can't believe two cows made the ultimate sacrifice so you guys could watch TV with your feet up. Well, they're chair-shaped cows. They never would have survived in the wild. The screen is amazing. I mean, Dick Van Dyke is practically life-size. Uh -huh. oh. Rosemary really belongs on a smaller screen, doesn't she? Hi, you guys. Hey. Hey, you. Hey, you. Hey, 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 hey. So, uh, how was your day? Oh, you know, pretty much the usual. Uh... Sun shining, birds chirping. Really? Mine too. Hey, cool, mine too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I gotta get to the museum. So, um, I'll see you tonight. Okay. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, we did it. We're here. We are standing our ground. How long does a cup of coffee take? Would you come on? Come on! Thank you. <laughs> ah, here we go. I think we proved our point. You burn your mouth? Cannot feel my tongue. All these big bullies. Oh, look who's here. It's the weenies. Did we not make ourselves clear the other day? Yes, and that's why we're here. Yes, we're standing our ground. Apparently. <laughs> Let's do this already. Right. Uh, whoa, 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 what do you got there, a weapon? It's a nice watch. I don't want to break it on your ribs. Uh, <laughs> All right, let's do this. All right. <clears throat> Question. If I don't care about my watch, can I use it as a weapon? What do you mean? Well, it's sharp, it's metal. I think I can do some, you know, serious damage with it. No, you can't use your watch. Oh, okay. Or your keys. Oh, okay. Look, here's what we'll do. We'll put all keys and watches in the hat over there. All right? All right, come on, man. Let's do it. Before I forget. Are we hitting faces? Of course we're hitting faces. Why wouldn't you hit faces? Well, because I have to work on Monday. I have a big presentation. Actually, you know, uh, I gotta show this apartment tomorrow, and, uh, you know, just no faces thing it might not be a bad idea. Okay? Nothing from the neck up. All right. Or the waist down. Dean is ovulating. Oh, really? You guys trying again? Yeah. Right, so let me just get this straight. So we're uh, strictly talking about the middle. Come on! Hey, hey, whoa, whoa, you want some of this, huh? You want a piece of this, huh? You're standing here, huh? Hey, hey, those guys are taking their stuff. Huh? Hey, get out of the way, look out! Hey! God, that was, that was amazing. That was incredible. You guys, you guys kicked butt. Us, what about you guys? Man, you really... Bing, gave it to old Mr. Clean back there. He was a big guy. Yeah, he was, wasn't he? <laughs> yeah, you know, I wouldn't know, having missed everything. Oh, don't do that to yourself. Any one of us could have tripped over that little girl's jump rope. <laughs> so, listen, guys, are we, uh... 
Are we okay here? <laughs> We're okay. All right. <laughs> okay, so can I have my hat back? <laughs> no. <laughs> huh. <laughs> uh, hey, Ross. <laughs> two more tables to clean and then we'll go, okay? Okay. I'll just sit here and uh, chat with your uh, friend type people. <laughs> <clears throat> Rachel? Um, hi. Hi. Okay, so you know what you're doing, right? <laughs> what you saying? Well, yeah, but no. I mean, um, <laughs> doesn't, doesn't Russ just remind you of, of someone? Huh. Bob Saget? <laughs> oh, yeah. No, 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 oh, oh. Hi. Oh, my, oh. What? What's wrong? I, okay. She's just upset because she, uh, she buttered a spider into her toast this morning. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Listen, Phoebs, this is gonna be okay. Ross, 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 Ross. <laughs> hi, hi. Are you a uh, friend of Rachel's? Yes, yes, I am. Are you a uh, a friend of Rachel's? Actually, I'm uh, kind of a you know a date type thing <laughs> of Rachel. Uh, a date? Yeah, I'm her date. Oh, oh, you're, uh, you're oh, you're. The day. You know, this is actually good, because if we ever lose Ross, we have a spare. Oh, you are the, uh, paleontologist. Yes, yes, I am. And you are a... <laughs> periodontist. See, now they're as different as night and... later that night. <laughs> well, I am going to, uh, get a beverage. <laughs> uh, it was nice, nice uh, meeting you. Ditto. Okay, can we watch Joey's show now, please? Yeah. What? He's not here yet. So? He's on the show. He knows what happens. Yeah. Oh, I'm fine about my problem now, by the way. Oh, good. <laughs> Amber, I want you to know that I'll always be there for you, as a friend and as your brother. Oh, Dre. What a day, huh? First the medical award. Alice? Yeah. Some guys are just lucky, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Ramore, report to first floor emergency stat. Oh, okay. Well then, uh, yeah, I guess that's me. Anyone else need to go in the elevator? Dr. Wong? <laughs> Dr. Wong? No, no. They only said you. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. I love you, Drake. Yeah, whatever. Did they just kill off Joey? No. <laughs> now maybe. <laughs> come on, Joey. open up, we want to talk to you. I don't feel like talking. Oh, come on, Joey, we care about you. We're worried about you. And some of us really have to pee. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, Joey. Hey. <laughs> Listen. Sorry about your death. That really sucks. Yeah. We came over as soon as we saw. How could you not tell us? I don't know. I was kind of hoping no one would ever find out. <laughs> well, maybe they could find a way to bring you back. Nah. They said that when they found my body, my brain was so smashed in that the only doctor who could have saved me was me. <laughs> it's supposed to be some kind of irony or something. <laughs> Joey, you're gonna be fine. You don't need that show. It was just a dumb soap opera. Phoebe, this was the greatest thing that ever happened to me. Yes, I was going to incorporate that. <laughs> oh, good, here's Monica. She'll have something nice to say. Um, I straightened out your shower curtain so you won't get mildew. <laughs> what? To me, that's nice. It's gonna be okay. You know that. No, I don't. 
It's like, you know, you work your whole life for something, and you think that when you get it, it's never gonna be as good as you thought it would be. But this so was. You know, it changed everything. Like, the other day, I got this credit card application, and I was pre-approved. <laughs> huh? I've never been pre-approved for anything in my life. I'm sorry, man. Yeah, Joey, honey, I don't know if this will mean anything to you, but you'll always be pre-approved with us. No, that means nothing to me. <laughs> Hey there. What? Nothing. I just heard something nice about you. Hmm. Really? Richard! Richard, your son isn't seeing anyone, is he? Uh, not that I know of. Well, I was thinking, why doesn't he give Monica a call? <laughs> that... that's an idea? Well, actually, I'm already seeing someone. Oh? Uh oh. Oh. <laughs> she never tells us anything. Ross, did you know Monica seeing someone? Mom, there are so many people in my life. <laughs> some of them are seeing people and some of them aren't. Is that Crystal? <laughs> so, who's the mystery man? Well, uh, he's a doctor. A real doctor? No, a doctor of meat. <laughs> he's a real doctor and he's handsome and he's sweet and I know you'd like him well that's wonderful I... <laughs> mom it's okay it is Judy Jack <laughs> could you come in here for a moment <laughs> no found it I'll take that down Your daughter and Richard are something of an item. That's impossible. He's got a Twinkie in the city. <laughs> Dad, I'm the Twinkie. You're the Twinkie? She's not a Twinkie. All right, look, look, you guys. This is the best relationship I've been oh, in. Oh, please. A relationship? Yes, a relationship. For your information, I am crazy about this man. Really? Yes. Oh. Am I supposed to stand here and listen to this on my birthday? Dad, Dad, this is a good thing for me. You know, and you even said yourself you'd never seen Richard happier. When did I say that? Upstairs in the bathroom right before you felt up mom. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Jack. Happy birthday to you. Your mom wants to say goodbye. Oh. Oh, happy birthday, sweetie. Okay. <laughs> oh. Uh, you drive safe. Okay. Uh, Ross, what are you doing? I'm getting ready for the water skiing. <laughs> How are you? <laughs> well, uh, Dr. Green, where are you going? To get my coat. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> All right, I can get my own coat. Oh. Uh, 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 <laughs> Sorry, we're on a major flan high. Oh, no. No, you're not supposed to be here. Because it's the staging area. You should, it's all wrong. You should leave. <laughs> you know, just get out. <laughs> Or perhaps you'd like a creme de menthe. <laughs> Have to be heading toward my chateau. Thank you. Oh, all right. Well, then I guess we're going back into the hallway again. Thanks for coming, Mrs. Green. <laughs> well, okay. You take care. Oh, you kids. <laughs> well, this is the best party I've been to in years. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Did we speak 
on the phone last night? Did you call me? No, I stayed at Julie's last night. Huh. Oh, actually, I haven't even been home yet. Do you mind if I check my messages? Oh, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> Rach, I got a message from you. <laughs> Who's Michael? Oh, my God. Oh, my God, Ross, no, hang up the phone. Give me the phone, Ross. Give me the phone, give me the phone. Give me the phone. Give me the phone. You're over me? Oh, God. What? You're, uh... Oh, God. You're, you're over me? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. When... Oh, God. When were you... under me? Oh, Rach. Oh. Rachel, do you... I mean, were you, uh... uh okay. What? Okay, okay. Well, basically, <clears throat> lately, I've, uh, <clears throat> I've, uh, sort of had feelings for you. <laughs> You've had feelings for me. Yeah, what? So, you had feelings for me first. Whoa. Huh. <laughs> you know about my, I mean, you know I had, you, you know? You... <laughs> Chandler told me. Chandler, when did he, when did he, when did he? <laughs> when you were in China. China. Meeting Julie. 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 That's do God. Julie. <laughs> Julie. Right. Okay, I need to lie down. <laughs> no, you know, I'm gonna stand. I'm gonna stand. And I'm gonna walk. I'm walking and I am standing. Okay, oh so you uh and now what and now now. Now you're over me? Are you over me? <laughs> oh my god, look, there's Roy Gublik! Ah! You know, Roy saw Star Wars 317 times. His name was in the paper. <laughs> Where's Chip? Why isn't he here yet? He'll be here, okay? Take a chill pill. There. <laughs> I just told Rachel that Roy touched my boob. <laughs> I can't go to my own prom without a date. I can't. It's too late. Well, if, you don't, if you're not going, then I don't want to go either. No. Oh, I'm going to kick Chip's ass. <laughs> I have a wonderful idea. You should take Rachel to the prom. <laughs> Doubtful. Jack, give me that. Talk to your son. Okay. All right, go okay. on. Okay. Okay. This thing's heavy. Your mother's right. Take her. You could wear my tux. Dad, she wouldn't want to go with me. Of course she would. You're a college man. I don't know. Well, come on. Don't you want to find out? I'm I can't believe I don't get to go to my own prom. Is it so harsh? Okay. Hold my board. Add a boy. Add a boy. Okay, you guys, you know, I think we've seen enough. Let's turn no, it off. No, 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 <laughs> okay, Dad. Rachel, ready or not, here comes your knight in shining. Oh, no. Bye, Chip! Oh, dear. Jack, how do I turn this off? Press the button. Which one? Which button, Jack? The button, the button. I can't believe you did that. Yeah, well. <gasps> oh, 
Okay, and then you take the poopy diaper and you put it in the poopy diaper pail. Okay, Ross, just so you know, calling it a poopy diaper doesn't make this process any cuter. <laughs> Hello. It's us. Come on up. I'm going to get the rest of this stuff together. Okay, we can do this now, can't we, Ben? Yes, we can. Yes, we can. There. I did it. <laughs> I did it. Ooh, look at that. Oh, stays on and everything. <laughs> Hi. Hi. I'm sorry. What did you just say? Did you just say hi? Oh, my God. Ross. Ross, Ben just said hi. What? what? Ben just said hi. What the word, ben hi? Hi. Yeah, no, my uncle, hi. What? <laughs> great, great. And I miss that, too. I miss everything. Oh, I'm sorry. I guess I just bring it out in him. Hello. 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 Oh, we miss you. I miss you so much. Come here, Ben. Hi. <laughs> Guess what? Ben just said his first word. <gasps> what did he say? Something about hi. Oh, that's so exciting. <laughs> Mommy is so proud of you. Hi. Hi? You know, actually, it's more like, hi. 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 Uh, OK, this could hi. go on for a while. <laughs> right. I've got a cab waiting downstairs. Well, this was fun. Uh, we should really do it again sometime, Ben. What do you say? OK. All right, so I've got him. Tuesday. Tuesday, right. OK. See Bye, you guys. You. Take Bye. care. Bye, Ben. Bye. Did, did he just, did he, did he just say, he said bye, he said bye, you said, he said bye to me, he said bye to me. Yes, he did. Oh, suddenly I'm seeing him go off to college. Oh, we gotta go, we've got that cat downstairs. Okay, all right, all right, yeah. okay. See you later. All right. Bye. 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 Oh. How did you get here so fast? I just saw you in Salem. Right, they, uh, they choppered me in. <laughs> What's up? Oh, and I see you're having a little party, too. Is she here? Huh? Huh? Who? Sabrina. I know about you two. I saw you today kissing in the doctor's lounge. That's not what you think. That was... You told me I was the only one. <laughs> All right, look, that's it. I don't think we should see each other anymore, all right? Look, I know I should have told you this a long time ago, but I am not Drake Ramore, okay? I'm not even a doctor. I'm an actor. I just pretend to be a doctor. Oh, my God. Do the people at the hospital know about this? <laughs> <laughs> Somebody want to help me out here? No, I know, I know. Where am I? University Hospital. The same place you've been for the last 18 years. How, how can you be here and there? Because <laughs> it's a television show. Drake, what are you getting at? <laughs> I'm not Drake. That's right. He's not Drake. He's Hans Ramore, Drake's evil twin. <laughs> Is this true? <laughs> yes, yes, it is true. And I know this because, because he pretended to be Drake to, to sleep with me. What? <laughs> and then he told me he would run away with me. And he did it. <laughs> and you left the toilet seat up, you bastard. <laughs> Is all this true? Yes. I'm afraid it is. You deserve much better than me, Erica. You deserve to be with the real Drake. He's the one you fell in love with. Go to Salem. Find him. He's the guy for you. Oh, Hans. Hans? Hans? Yo, evil twin. <laughs> Goodbye, Erica. Good luck in Salem. Take care. 
I'll never forget you, Hans. Hey. <laughs> Mr. Douglas is looking for you. Why? 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 Why is Mr. Douglas looking for me? Because he has a strong suspicion that you dropped the ball on the lender project. Why? 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 Why, why does he suspect that? <laughs> because at first he thought it was Joseph. But after he asked Joseph about it, it turns out it was you. <laughs> anyway, I just thought you should know. All right, that's it. Look, Joey, I'm sorry. I realize this is the role of a lifetime for you. And if I could just fire Joseph, I would. But unfortunately, that's not possible, so I'm gonna have to let both of you go. <laughs> what are you talking about? Everybody loves Joseph. I don't. I hate Joseph. Okay, I think he's a brown-nosing suck-up. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, you can't fire Joseph. You know why? Because he's not in your department. <gasps> yeah. All right, okay, all right. I, so I can't fire Joseph, but uh, I can sleep with his wife. <laughs> Karen? Yeah, Karen. I'm thinking about having an affair with her. Oh, you know what? I just did. <gasps> What the hell are you doing to me, man? Oh, well, it's not me. It's my character. Chandy. <laughs> yeah, the rogue processor who seduces his co-workers' wives for sport and then laughs about it the next day at the water cooler. In fact, I have her panties right there in my drawer. Really? No, freak show, she's fictional! Oh, hey, take it easy. If it means that much to you, I'll, uh... I'll go find something else. <sighs> Thank you. Just that you know, I'm, I'm gonna miss Joseph. I liked him. His wife. She was hot. <laughs> Ow. you guys took off. Oh, no, 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 she took off. With my clothes! Are you naked in there? Well, not exactly. I'm wearing panties. Huh. You, uh, you always wear panties? No, no, this is the first time. Wow, talk about your bad luck. I mean... The first time you try panties and someone walks off with your clothes. <laughs> I was not trying them out. Susie asked me to wear them. Well, let me see. No. I'm not letting you or anybody else see ever. All right, all right. Whoa. Someone's flossing. Joey, uh, some people don't like that. Chandler's wearing panties. What? Let me see. No, no, you don't have to see. Hi, Tushy. All right. Why don't you give me your underpants? Oh, no, no, no. Can't help you. I'm not wearing any. How can you not be wearing any underwear? Oh, I'm getting heat from the guy in the hot pink thong. All right, look, Ross, I'll give you $50 for your underpants. Hey. hey. Come on, Chandler, I want this part so much. Just one kiss, I won't tell him. <laughs> Joey, no means no. Hey! I'm sorry, we don't have your sheep. <laughs> Rich, I think you look cute. <laughs> and you, huh, you. You I could eat with a spoon. Get away from me, I said no. Richard Buzz, he's waiting downstairs. Uh, oh, Richard's here? I should run down and say goodbye to him. Bye. 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 Good luck. So, how's your date with your cyber chick going? 
Oh, hey, what is all that? Oh, it's a website. It's the uh, Guggenheim Museum. Oh. See, uh, she likes art, and I like funny words. <laughs> what does she mean by HH? It means we're holding hands. Are you the cutest? I'm afraid I might just be. <laughs> you know what I think is so great that you are totally into this person, yet for all you know, she could be like 90 years old or have two heads or... <laughs> it could be a guy. Okay, it's not a guy, all right? I know her. It could be like a big giant guy. <laughs> Man, I got this close to him, and Monica need me in the back. <laughs> What's going on? We were just wondering if Chandler's girlfriend's a girl. No, oh, well, just ask her how long she's gonna live. Women live longer than men. <laughs> how do you not fall down more? Okay, ask her what is her current method of birth control. All right. My husband is sleeping with his secretary. She's married? Well, at least we know she's a woman. I can't believe she's married. Oh, man, I'm sorry. This must be really tough for you, huh? Oh, God. Oh, God. I mean, it's just so, isn't it? Uh, I mean, this is like reading about my own life. I mean, this book could have been called Be Your Own Windkeeper, Rachel. Yeah, I don't think it would have sold a million copies, but it would have made a nice gift for you. Hey, you guys. Hey. Uh, sweetie, we've got to go. No! No? <laughs> no! Why do we always have to do everything according to your timetable? Actually, it's the movie theater that has the timetable. <laughs> it's so you don't miss the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> no, see, this isn't about the movie theater. This is about you stealing my wind. <laughs> you go, girl! <laughs> I can't pull that off, can I? <laughs> Excuse me, your, uh, your... your wind? Yes, my wind. How do you expect me to grow if you won't let me blow? You, you know I, I don't have a, have a, a problem with that. Okay. I just, I just really, need to be with myself right now. I'm sorry. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Are you right? I don't have to apologize. Sorry. Damn it! Hey, Rach. Want to hear the new song I'm thinking of singing this afternoon? I wrote it this morning in the shower. Okay. <clears throat> I'm in the shower and I'm writing a song. Stop me if you heard it. <laughs> my skin is soapy and my hair is wet. And Tegrin spelled backward is Nergit. Uh, Rachel, sweetheart, could I see you for a minute? <clears throat> What's up? Uh. FYI, I've decided to pay a professional musician to play in here on Sunday afternoons. Her name is Stephanie something. I, uh, she's supposed to be very good. But, but what about Phoebe? Uh, Rachel, uh, it's not that your friend is bad. It's, it's that she's so bad. <laughs> she makes me want to put my finger through my eye into my brain and swirl it around. <laughs> Okay, okay, so you're not a fan, but I mean, come on, you cannot do this to her. Uh... Oh, no, 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 oh, no, 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 I have to do this to her? Mm -hmm. Lather, rinse, repeat, and lather, rinse, repeat, and lather, rinse, repeat, as needed. <laughs> but, but this is my gig. I mean, this is where I play. 
My, my name is written out there in chalk. You know, you can't just erase chalk. <laughs> Honey, I'm sorry. And he's going to be paying this woman? Well, why doesn't he just give her like a throne and a crown and, and like a, you know, gold stick with a ball on top? <laughs> Terry is a jerk, okay? That's why we're always saying Terry's a jerk. That's where that came from. <laughs> yeah, okay. You probably did everything you could. So. Okay, you know what? Let, let me just see what else I can do. All right, look, look. Why don't you just let her go on after Stephanie, whatever her name is? I mean, you won't be here. You don't pay her. It's not going to cost you anything. Uh, I, I don't know. Oh, come on, Terry. I'll even clean the cappuccino machine. You don't clean the cappuccino machine? <laughs> I clean it. I mean, I, I will clean it. I mean, I will clean it. Oh, all right. Fine, fine, fine. Done. Really? Yeah. Who's working for you, babe? Oh, oh my God. This is so exciting. No. How much am I going to get? What? Well, you said he's paying the people who were playing, so. Oh. No, no, no. I, I meant he's going to be paying that other woman because she's a professional. Well, I'm not going to be the only one who's not getting paid. Well, but Phoebe. No, huh? I'm sorry. No. No, I'm not some, like, sloppy second, you know, charity ban. And you know what? There are thousands of places in this city where people would be happy to pay to hear me play. When I play, I play for me. I don't need your charity. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, whoa. Oh, thanks. Couldn't, uh... Is everything okay? Um, no. Uh-uh. Um... <clears throat> one of my clients died on the massage table today. Oh! Oh, my God. Well, that's a little more relaxed than you want them to get. <laughs> yeah, uh-huh. Um, <clears throat> she was, you know, 82 years old. And, um, her name was, um, Mrs. Edelman. Oh, honey? Yeah, it's just so strange. I mean, you know, she probably woke up this morning and thought, all right, so I'll have some breakfast and I'll take a little walk and, and you know, then I'll have my massage. And little did she know, God was thinking, okay, but that's it. <laughs> oh, oh, but the weirdest thing was, okay, um, I was cleansing her aura when it happened and when, when her spirit left her body, I don't think it went very far. <clears throat> what do you mean? I, I, I think it went into me. <laughs> oh, that's him. Dan, my mail order grandfather hasn't come yet. Phoebe? <laughs> yes. Hi, Mr. Edelman. Nice to see you. Hi, thanks for meeting me. Oh, that's all right, although you did cut into my very busy day of sitting. Oh. <laughs> um, Oh, do you want to sit? Oh, no, 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 please. I spent most of mid-morning trying to stand up. <laughs> now, uh, what can I do for you, my dear? Oh, okay. I don't know how to say this, but, um, I think when your wife's spirit left her body, it, um, kind of stuck around in me. You're saying my wife is in you? Yeah. Okay, you don't have to believe me, but, um, can you think of any unfinished business she might have had? Like, any reason she'd be hanging around? Well, I don't know what to tell you, dear. The only thing I could think of is that she always used to say that before she died, she wanted to see everything. Everything? Everything. Whoa, that's a lot of stuff. Oh, wait, I, I, I remember. She also said she wanted to sleep with me one last time. <laughs> There's laughing in my head. <laughs> Worth a shot, huh? Now, what have I not told you? Oh, I don't know. Um, how about the fact that the underwear out there on the telephone pole is yours from when you were having sex with fun Bobby out on the terrace? What? Wait a minute. Who told you? You are dead meat. I didn't know it was a big secret. <laughs> oh, it's not big. Not at all. You know, kind of on the same lines as, 
say, oh, I don't know, having a third nipple. <gasps> you have a third nipple? You bitch. <laughs> whip it out, whip it out. Yeah, yeah. There's nothing to see. It's just a tiny bump. It's totally useless. Oh, as, as opposed to your other multifunctional nipples. I can't believe you. You told me it was a nubbin. Joey, what do you think a nubbin was? I don't know. You see something, you hear a word. I thought that's what it was. <laughs> Let me see it again. Joey was in a porno movie. <laughs> If I'm going down, I'm taking everybody with me. What? All right, all right, all right, all right. I was young and I just wanted a job, okay? But at the last minute, I couldn't go through with it. So they let me be the guy who comes in to fix the copier, but can't, because there's people having sex on it. Uh, that is wild! <laughs> so what's it shaped like? Yeah, is there a hair on it? What happens if you flick it? must have been sweeping. They found a broom in his hand. Oh, oh, dear oh. God. That's terrible. I know. I was sweeping yesterday. Could have been me. Yeah. <laughs> you were sweeping. Uh, you never know. Never know. <laughs> Uh-oh, it's Isaac Newton and he's pissed. <laughs> oh, there she is. And over there, that's the other one. This is Mr. Buddy Boyle, Heckle's attorney. He'd like to talk to you. Okay, well, what can we do for you? All right, kids, here's the deal. According to my client's will, he wants to leave all his earthly possessions to the uh, noisy girls in the apartment above mine. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but what about his family? He didn't have any. Whoa. Oh. Okay, so let's talk money. All right, there was none. Now, let's talk signing. You be noisy girl number one, you be noisy girl number two. I can't believe that this whole time we thought he hated us. I mean, isn't it amazing how much you can touch someone's life without even knowing it? Would you look at this dump? He hated us. This was his final revenge. Ever seen so much crap? Actually, I think this apartment sullies the good name of crap. <laughs> Check this out. He's gotta get my coat. He's gotta get my coat, darling. This is unbelievable. What's that? What? Nothing. What? Wow, it's, it's on my name. What is it? No, no. See? See? Hey, it's printing. Someone order a coat? Pass, Chandler wrote something about me on his computer and he won't let me see. He won't, he won't. <laughs> because isn't that isn't that the, the 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 short story you were writing? Yes, yes it is the short story <laughs> that I was writing. In a minute? Well, let me read it. No. no. <laughs> Come on! Hey, uh, why don't you read it to her? It was summer, and it was hot. Rachel was there. A lonely gray couch. Oh, look, cried Ned. And then the kingdom was his forever, the end. 
That's it? That's all you wrote? You're the worst writer in the whole world! All right, all right. You know what? This isn't funny anymore. There's something about me on that piece of paper, and I want to see it. No, you don't. Uh, you know what? Fine. If you guys want to be children about this, that's fine. I do not need to see it! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> That is, okay, um, that's, that's, no, no, no. It, uh, Ross, what is this? Thank you. Good luck. <laughs> okay, just, just remember how crazy I am about you, okay? Kind of ditzy. <clears throat> Too into her looks. Spoiled. Now, that's a little spoiled. He was supposed to type little, the idiot. <laughs> <laughs> just a waitress? Now, that, that was, uh... I mean, as opposed to, uh, the, um, okay, is, is this over yet, <laughs> Rach? Uh, I do not have chubby ankles. <laughs> no, 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 wait, 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 okay, okay, look at the other side. Look at Julie's column. She's not Rachem? Oh. What the hell's a Rachem? No. <laughs> That's a stupid paleontology word that I wouldn't know because I'm just a waitress. No. Rach, come on, Rach, Rach. Wait, no, 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 it's, it's, she's not Rachel. She's, she's not, Ra Rachel. Oh, hi. Yeah, hold on a second. Ross, Julie, for you. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hey, anybody know a good tailor? You need some clothes altered? No, no, I'm just looking for a man to draw on me with chalk. <laughs> Why don't you go see Frankie? My family's been going to him forever. He did my first suit when I was 15. No, wait, 16. No, excuse me, 15. All right, when was 1990? Okay, you have to stop the Q-tip when there's resistance. Okay, okay, sweetheart, I'll see you later. <clears throat> okay, bye. What? Oh, that is so sweet. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, okay. No, you hang up. No, you... Okay. Okay. One, two, three. <laughs> well, you didn't hang up either. She didn't hang up. <laughs> Okay, no, no, you hang up. You, you, you. Sorry, I thought you were talking to me. <laughs> Rachel, I'll just call her back. Okay. I'm sorry, we got disconnected. Okay, 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 okay. How did this happen to me? How did this happen to me? A week ago, two weeks ago, I was fine. Ross was just Ross, just this guy. Now all of a sudden he's Ross. Oh, this really great guy that I can't have. Sweetie, I wanted you to have him too. I know you did. Oh, I'm just gonna deal with it. I'm just gonna deal with it. <laughs> Okay, I don't care what you guys say. Something is bothering her. Hi, welcome to our tropical Christmas party. You put your coats and sweaters and pants and shirts in the bedroom. It's hard to tell because I'm sweating, but I use exactly what the gel bottle says. <laughs> An amount about the size of a pea. How, how can that be too much? Ice? Ice? Ice squares, anyone? Take a napkin. All right. Monica, Monica. Monica, your guests are turning into jerky, okay? Good. I'm perfectly comfortable. Hey, 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 get in line, buddy. I was next. <laughs> Mr. Traeger. Uh, you said there was a party. Oh, yeah. Well, hey, welcome to our sauna. <laughs> uh, is it hot? <laughs> My body always stays cool. 
Probably because I have so much skin. <laughs> hey, jeez. <laughs> All right. All right, here's the chance. Monica, give him cash. Rachel, give him your earrings. It's something now, anything. No, I will not cave. Yeah, I'm with Mon. All right, all right. You know how you say I never seize the day? Well, all right, even though he's your super, I'm seizing. Mr. Trigger, <laughs> here is 50 bucks. Merry Christmas. Oh, wow. <laughs> I didn't get you anything. <laughs> here's five back. <laughs> No, 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 that's that's your Christmas tip, all right? Oh, hey, do you think there's a chance uh, you can fix that radiator now? Uh, no can do. <laughs> like I told the girl, I gotta get a new knob until Tuesday. Ross? Yeah? Looks like he's playing baseball. You mean hardball? <laughs> Whatever. What you gonna do? Excuse me, I'm seizing. Mm -hmm. Mr. Traeger? <clears throat> Here's another 50. Happy Hanukkah. <laughs> will, uh, will this help with the knob getting? No. The place is not open till Tuesday. Am I not saying it right? <laughs> so, wait, you really did like my cookies? Oh, yeah. They were so personal. Really showed you cared. <laughs> <laughs> nice seizing. Gel boy. <laughs>